Welcome. In today's tutorial, I am using six pictures in a picture background. Let's start by going to File. Under Project Settings, change the aspect ratio to 4 to 5. Now go to Stock Media. Under Solid Color, drag down a white color. Now right-click to crop to fit then click to apply a rectangular mask. Afterward, scroll down to change the width to 62, height to 64, position Y to 113, blur strength to 2 and invert mask. Now go to Gradient Color to drag down a black gradient color below on track 1. Crop to fit then take a snapshot. Afterward, delete the gradient color. Drag down a picture. Crop to fit then take a snapshot. Now continue to delete the picture below. Drag down another and take as many snapshot as you want depending on the number of pictures you intend to use. I was able to make about 6 snapshots. Next, delete all on the timeline. Go to File. Under Project Settings change back the aspect ratio to 16 to 9 as shown. Now drag down a picture background. Crop to fit and extend as you wish depending on number of pictures. Now drag down the black frame snapshot made earlier. Click to scale down to 60. Now apply keyframes position, rotation and drop shadows including distance and opacity. Now go back type minus 1235 in position X. Change rotation to minus 180. Scroll down to drop shadow. Change distance and opacity to 170 respectively. Move playhead 3 frames forward. Go back restore both position and rotation to 0 then scroll down to drop shadow to type 10 and 80 for both distance and opacity respectively. Now preview. You will notice it will animate from left side out of the screen to the center of the screen. Now move the playhead 2 frames forward form the second keyframe below then drag down a picture snapshot made earlier. Click the picture to scale down to 60 to match with the vertical black frame picture snapshot below. Then apply drop shadows change distance to 10 and opacity to 80. Apply dissolve transition within 12 seconds interval and preview. Move back the playhead to the end of the transition then copy and paste the black frame snapshot above. Click the first keyframe to only change the position X to minus 1228 and Y to 553 then click the second keyframe to change rotation to 20 and other to animate from the top left corner to the center with slant rotation. Copy effect from the picture snapshot below. Move playhead 2 frames form the last keyframe above. Drag down another picture snapshot. Paste effect. Click to change rotation to 20 to match the slant black frame picture below. And apply dissolve transition and adjust to 12 seconds. Move playhead to the end of the transition below. Copy and paste the black frame snapshot above. Click the first keyframe to only change the position Y to minus 553 to animate from the bottom left side out of the screen then click the second keyframe to change rotation to minus 20. Move playhead 2 frames forward from the last keyframe above. 
copy effect from snapshot picture below and then drag down another picture snapshot to paste the effect. Now click the picture to change rotation to minus 20 afterward apply dissolve transition with 12 seconds frame. Now to make another 3 set of slides to animate from the right side, we do this. Move the playhead to the end of the transition below then go the very first black frame snapshot to copy and paste above. Click the first keyframe to only change the position X to 1235. Now move playhead 2 frames from the last keyframe below. Then go to the first picture snapshot to copy effect then go up to drag down another picture snapshot above and paste effect then apply dissolve transition within 12 seconds. Again move playhead to the end of the transition below then go down to copy and paste the second black frame snapshot below. Click the first keyframe to only change the position X to 1228 to animate from the top right corner out of the screen. Scroll down to copy effect from the second picture snapshot below. Move playhead two frames forward from the last keyframe. Drag down another picture snapshot above and paste the effect. Apply dissolve transition within 12 seconds in preview. Move playhead to the end of the dissolve transition. Go down to copy and paste the third black frame snapshot above. Click the first keyframe to only change the position X to 1228. Now move playhead two frames from the last keyframe below. Then go to the third picture snapshot to copy effect then go up to drag down another picture snapshot above and paste effect then apply dissolve transition within 12 seconds. Move playhead forward to 12 seconds or after the black frame snapshot below. Click picture to apply keyframe to both scale and opacity. Now move the playhead 3 frames forward. Go back to scale to the maximum 400 and scroll down to opacity to reduce to minimum 0. Now click the second keyframe. Go down to the previous picture snapshot to apply keyframe to both scale and opacity. Again move playhead 3 frames forward, then go back to scale to 400 and opacity to 0. Again from the second keyframe above, go down to the third picture snapshot below to apply keyframe to both scale and opacity. Again move playhead 3 frames forward, then go back to scale to 400 and opacity to 0. Now continue the same process until the last picture snapshot. above. You can apply heartbeat shake effect and click to reduce to 3 and within 5 frames interval. Now scroll down to the first picture snapshot below. Drag down text title. Edit as shown then you are good to go. Thanks for watching you are awesome. 
please subscribe and have a very great day.